Hey folks, here at osmptactories.com, you're watching our video review of the LED message board clock. This is a very unique clock because it also displays a semi-transparent view of different messages that you can actually program, including different occasions for birthdays and special events that you can write in or use these uh, memos that are actually built in. It records up to actually 30 different messages on board, which is actually pretty good, and also displays the basic time and calendar and date information as you might expect. However, as a basic clock, it doesn't have any speaker on board, so it isn't actually an alarm clock, just a basic clock slash message board. Also, price at $80 device is also quite expensive. However, if you're considering the message board functionality, uh, typical LED message boards tend to cost around $50, so it actually comes to be a pretty good price, uh, especially also for the technological you know, a conversation starter aspect of this device. Um, again, having this, you would definitely spark conversations with your friends and family, so if you're looking for something that's interesting to put on your desk and surface, it's definitely worth the attention and closer look. The device comes in two color iterations, the black and also the silver version that we have here. As far as build quality is concerned, it's actually pretty flimsy, and we were kind of surprised that you know the build quality justified the price tag at first. Technology is actually pretty cool. It relies on a spinning disc that uh, vibrates back and forth in order for the messages to be displayed. The actual LEDs are only about six to seven LEDs displayed in a vertical column, and when the device is actually stopped, you can actually see that a lot more clearer. When the device is turned on, the display itself is semi-transparent, and you can actually put a finger behind it. It looks like the actual display is floating in thin air for a very cool effect. However, the device tends uh, to produce quite a lot of vibration as well. So when the device is placed on surfaces that are not so flat, it tends to vibrate out of control. But however, an automatically, automatic safety feature allows the device to be turned off when the vibration gets too strong and vigorous. For example, if we tilt the device slightly, you can see how the clock will start to fade and then eventually turn off. If we turn the device off for a second and take a closer look at the mechanics of how the device works, again, it's going to eventually stop uh, vibrating, and you can see, again, it's just a few LEDs being programmed to display these messages in a very clever fashion. As far as the speed is considered, as long as you don't have kids sticking their fingers in here, you still should be safe. And also, the plastic utilized on here is also very soft and malleable, so it also won't hurt your fingers too much if you accidentally put your fingers in there either, as far as safety is concerned. Otherwise, the controls are uh, mainly navigatable from the back of the unit with the power on and off switch, two selection keys for the time and date, and some selection modes for different messages and a stop button. The buttons are all pretty tactile and risen above the surface of the unit for easy access, and they're hidden in the back so they won't be displayed when the device is actually turned on, which is pretty cool. The bottom of the device features the AC power adapter. Something to note here is that even though the device can also take AAA batteries, the batteries here are just for backup purposes. So for example, if I set the time and date and the batteries die or if I unplug it from the wall, I can actually um, plug it into another wall and have it still display the same time and date so it's saved in here as a memory unit. However, the actual batteries themselves will not power the clock. It's not sufficient power. So some downsides to this clock, of course, is the fact that it requires a very flat surface. It also requires uh, you to make some sacrifices in terms of the price tag and you know the fact that it's not going to display any alarms. So it's not going to be your day-to-day -day clock. And also the fact that, um, again, it can't be uh, an a entirely battery-operated device. You have to plug it into the wall. Otherwise, it is a pretty cool effect. The LEDs also come in multiple colors. This is a red version. It also comes in a blue version, which is equally as cool. The price tag is the same, however, at $80 a piece. You can purchase the device on Amazon.com and also select stores and retailers around the nation. Again, it's cycling through some of the clock features now that you can see. It works pretty cool, and the animations are also def definitely pretty entertaining to watch them uh, fade in and out of the screen slowly and then slide back and forth, and it's like almost like a PowerPoint slideshow. You don't really expect what's coming, and for that reason, we definitely would recommend this as a conversation starter. Uh, if you're looking for something that's unique, a very unique clock, you will get with this device indeed. So we just take a few seconds of silence to appreciate the clock as we turn off the lights or dim the lights and see the clock in action. And I'm going to hit the switch here as well. And the camera doesn't do such a great job of picking up the redness of the display, but it's very red. It's almost like a laser, so it's very easy to read even from afar and from a distance. And it's very bright and vibrant, and um, viewing angles are not an issue unless you see it from the back, uh, because the LEDs only stretch to about 180 degrees from the front. But again, very cool, very interesting device. Definitely uh, intrigued by it. And of course, we have a full review posted on our website at OSMBTX Reviews. 
So thanks for watching. This has been our video review of the LED message clock.